Well guys, Happy New Year I guess. Today is January 2nd, so I uh, <clears throat> we're going to go uh, haul corn today and uh, I think that's going to be just about it for me, but anyway, I'm probably going to be able to get two, maybe three loads in if we're lucky. A little bit of a later start because I did school and stuff this morning because I don't get a school break, but it's partially because I uh, skipped a little too much school this fall. So anyway, get the coming started and uh, we'll get going. the elevator now so uh, we're just going to go in I gotta get the I gotta fill it up we didn't uh, fill it up last time because we weren't sure what we were going to be doing so I gotta fill the truck and then Dominic is going to come ride with me I guess for today so he'll uh, he'll be down here in a little bit so all in all it ought to work out just fine Should work, it worked last time, good enough anyway. Yeah, we have plenty. For the couple loads that we're gonna be able to do today anyway. Come in here. This box does the leg. Turn it on. Let us sit here and run a little bit. Get it all warmed up and make sure nothing's going to grenade itself. Okay, let's move them. This one turns on this hopper right here. It's going through there now. So I'm also going to turn on that one down there. But first, I'm going to go and make sure it's not uh, overflowing or something. Oh, perfect. Okay, uh, go back over here, make sure the door is shut on this one, the far one. Which I do believe it is. Let's come over here and look. Well, I would assume so anyway, so, okay. Now let's go flick this leg on, or drag, and uh, see what happens, I guess. The auger that, the front, well, one that's running is sped so that it won't overfill the auger, or the leg. But the one that brings it from the other bin over to the one that's running now can't overfill it and bubble up and out, but there's a little cap so it won't break anything anyway. So, this one does that. Okay. Okay, I have a feeling that's way too full. Yeah, we're getting full. <laughs> Shut that off. Okay. Okay, let me figure out what we got going on here. Okay, so I got them running now, but Somebody um, over the, yeah, it's been about a week, opened up the front trailer door, the front hopper on the trailer. So, somebody opened up this hopper right here, which then means that there was, it's really loud too. There's about 50 to 100 bucks on the corn center right there. A little bit ago. Alrighty, that's full, so uh, come in here and get everything shut off. Gotta let the leg clean out. Okay, we're good. Push the stop. Now ready to go. Let's go to the silos. Hey Dom, 
I'm gonna back up. I didn't fall enough. Okay. Alrighty, we got the uh, trucks filled up and loaded pretty nice now, so we're going to uh, head to the ethanol plant. The good part is it's only 30, about 30 minutes, so it's not bad. It's not real bad at all to get there, which is good. Just about there already. Just gotta go through a little bit of town up here and then we're there. Then I guess after today, after I'm done hauling my last load of corn, I'm gonna jump into Freightliner or something and uh, go bring a load of corn gluten into the propet and the fat food plant. Make your resolution a reality. A little bit of truck to do today. The reason Dom has to climb in here like that is because that door is a little messed up. Yeah, if I unlock it, it'll just fly it'll open. Fly open, something's not right. The other day, the first trip we took over here, I was riding with Dad. Turned the corner a little fast, and luckily I was half a, halfway ready for it to come open, and it came open. <laughs> All right. I'm saving that to camera roll. Well, boom! Do you still have the camera on? Yeah.
15, so. But, yeah, I got more bushels. <laughs> Okay, I got a good tarp this. We uh, ran out of corn in both silos, so we can't take out the side draws anymore. Which means we got to start taking out of the leg. So we got to uh, got to do that another day because I don't know how to do it. Actually, I've never been. Nobody's ever showed me how to. Just like that, we're weighed in. I gotta go in there and give him the paperwork and he's gotta enter it all in the system and I gotta sign a bunch of papers and all this stuff, so we're good to go. Alrighty, an hour later and we're empty. So I gotta go, uh, Go way out, get my paperwork and stuff that I need, and then we're going home. Well, we're at the elevator now, so I'm going to uh, got to take some paperwork, put in the other truck so it's ready to go when it goes in, when that load of gluten goes in. So, get this thing shut off. We'll go do that. Here's the paper. Only one of the three papers needs to go inside the truck. It's a certificate of analysis. Just tells them everything about it. And they need one for every load off of every car. So there's only three loads on from this one car. So this here will be the last load. Will be the last uh, last time we need that COA. So anyway, I'm gonna go home. Uh, that's it for me today. If you guys liked what you saw, make sure to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. You can also follow me on Snapchat at Farm Brothers 3, Instagram at Pullman Farms. I'll uh, catch you guys in the next video.